Hi everybody, welcome to the workout. We're gonna start with arm upper body warm up, palms up, and we're gonna be sawing back and forth to get the blood flowing. Palms up, and you're gonna turn your hands to knuckles up, back and forth. About 10 reps per side. Palms face you, thumbs up, sawing back and forth. Keep your abs tight and we're gonna go to rocking the baby. Knuckles up, over, under, back and forth. You're rocking the baby. Getting those shoulders and neck and abs warmed up. We're gonna go with the palms up, back and forth. and palms face you, over, under. And then we're gonna go into a palm press. So you're gonna press your palms like you're praying, raise your elbows, press hard, and just keep pressing for a moment, feeling it through the chest. And we're gonna press our pinky finger really hard. Our ring finger, our middle finger, Press the index finger, one finger at a time, and the thumb. Press hard, and we're gonna wind the clock back and forth with your palm pressing. Keep your elbows up, winding the clock and warming up your arms. And that's 10, and we're gonna go back and forth, left to right. Pressing with your palms hard and your fingers touching, and then you're gonna pause and go into a spider press. So the fingers separate, fingertips touch, press as hard as you can and feel the tension through the chest and core. And we're gonna wind the clock again, winding, wind it up. Breathing fluidly, abs tight, and shake, shake it out. And we're gonna do small circles with our arms. So palms are down, the hands are in front of the legs, and we're gonna circle. Small circles. And go to the middle size circle, a little bit bigger. And now you're gonna go for the big circle, big circles. Eight, nine, ten. Warming up the arms. You're going to go backwards, big circles. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And medium size back. Medium size circles going backwards. Eight, nine, ten. And back to the small circles. Stay with me, now we're gonna go thumbs up. Small circles, a little quicker, warming up. Small circles, medium-sized circles. Large circles. Getting that whole shoulder blade area warmed up. And backwards, thumbs up circles. Back, we're doing about 10. My counting isn't always perfect. Medium size, just a little bit smaller. Hands are staying in front of the thighs. Thumbs are up and small circles backwards. All right, then the last circuit of this one is thumbs down, forward circles. A few more of this. Medium size, thumbs down circles and large. And backwards large. Big wide circles. Small circles. And shake it out, shake it out. 
You're gonna do one more kind of fun and confusing thing with the arms. We're starting to feel warmed up now. And we're gonna take one thumb off, facing your hands facing you, the other thumb down and interlock your fingers. Okay, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull hard, pull your fingers hard apart, but keep them connected. And we're gonna circle forwards. So you should feel the tension through the shoulders, everybody. You're pulling the fingers apart, but keeping them connected. Now go the other direction. And then we're gonna rock the baby. That means back and forth. Rock the baby, pull the fingers hard apart, but keep them interlocked. Feel it in the waist, feel it in the core. And we're gonna circle forward with the elbows as you're pulling hard apart, like you're swimming. And we're gonna circle backwards. Keep pulling. Feel the burn in the shoulders. And shake it and switch. Okay, now you're gonna push. Push them hard together. They're still interlocked, but you're pushing, feeling through the, ch the chest. We're gonna go back and forth, rock the baby. As you push the hands hard together, Keep your knees relaxed. And we're gonna swim forward. Keep the fingers pressing tightly. And swim backwards. Pause. Keep pressing. And now we're gonna circle forwards. Good job, everybody. Circle backwards. And shake it out. You should be feeling warm now. So we're gonna add the legs. We got the upper body warmed up and we're gonna do what's called air squats. You wanna sit back. You wanna press your hands together for some core strength. And you're gonna go into the, to the imaginary chair and up. And we're gonna do 20, guys. Three, squeeze the butt on the way up. Four, press your hands together for core involvement. And keep going, give me 20. Press and lift, push through the floor. And that's 10 with 10 to go. One, two, three, four. Abs tight, everybody. Six, seven, get those legs warmed up. Eight, nine, and 10. Great job. Now we're gonna go into a lunge. If you can see me, I hope you can. We're gonna go into a lunge. Okay, because I wanna, the legs, you can see the legs, okay? Um, yes, now. Yeah. Okay, so we're going into a lunge, everybody. Right leg forward, let's just start with that. Arms are out, and we're gonna do a helicopter. You make sure there's enough room for you all. And that means we're gonna twist. Twist right, twist left. If you, if you have trouble with your balance, separate your feet wider, not so narrow. Feeling it in the stomach, working those obliques. That's eight, nine, feel the burn in the legs. That's 10 and up and switch. We're gonna put the left leg forward, right leg back. Helicopter number two. Get down into the lunge though and twist left and right for 10 reps. Posture tall. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Great. Legs are burning. We're going to use them to do an ab crunch standing up. Hands are going to go behind the head. We're gonna meet opposite elbow to opposite knee. So it's ab crunch down. Let's do 10. Ab crunch down, alternating. Looking straight ahead when both feet are down. So good posture, eye focus straight. We got five more left, four, three, two, and one, 
Great job. Let's go wide legs. Stretch out your legs. Arms are out. And we're going to alternate inside ankle with the opposite hand and alternate. Your knees can bend. And we're going to do 10. Each side is one. So we're on three and three. Twisting your spine, working your core. And five, six, seven, breathing, nine, and 10. Okay, and keep the legs wide. And we're gonna go into a side lunge. Side lunge, hold it, press through the floor, and switch it, alternate. And so we're gonna do 10. Try to keep the shin vertical as you switch. You're pressing through the floor up and over. So let's go a little quicker. Three, four, five, posture tall, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good. All right, everybody, we're gonna get to the knees now. We're gonna go down to the knees and I'm gonna lower the camera and I wanna show you, we're gonna test your balance a little bit. Okay, and we're gonna all go to our knees and we're gonna step out with one foot and you're gonna bring it back to kneeling. Step out with the other foot and bring it back. Okay, so we're gonna do that four times. Each leg is one. Try not to airplane with the arms and we go back to the other leg. So that's three and three. Let's go one more rep, everybody. Four and four. This time you're gonna put your hands behind your head. You're gonna raise your right leg and you're gonna twist right and back. And then put your leg down and switch other leg, twist toward it and back. So let's do it three more times. Right leg twist right, put it back. Left leg twist left and put it back. So right twist, left twist. One more time guys, right twist it. Left leg forward twist it. With the left leg I want you to try to come up to standing and back down again, four times. Up to standing, use the quadricep, back down again. Keep your balance. That's three and four. Place the left knee down, put the right leg up. We're gonna go four on the other leg. So you're gonna come up through the leg, press up, stand tall, come down to kneeling. And up. Two, we're gonna do four, and down. Up for three, back to kneeling, and up for four, and kneeling. Switch, both knees down. Now we're gonna add a little, a little extra challenge. You're gonna go left leg out, bring your right leg up, bring it back down. Reset, so switch, right leg forward, Bring your left knee up, bring it back down. Do your best. You might lose your balance a little and switch three more times. Left leg up, stand up, raise your leg and down. Switch it, right leg, stand up, raise your left knee, use your core and down. Two more times guys, left leg, stand up, right leg up and down. Really good, switch it. Right leg up, left knee up. One more because my counting is off. Let's just do left leg up, stand up, raise, switch. Right leg up, left knee up and down. Good job everybody. And from here, since we're already on our knees, let's go to hands and knees. You're on your hands and knees and we're gonna put the left leg up 
the weight of your leg is gonna strengthen your butt. Bring it back down, knee in front. Again, same leg, left leg up, hold it up, press through the hands, bring it back down. You're on all fours, knees and hands. Now your left leg goes back up, working that butt muscle and down. Let's go one more time, left leg up and down and switch it. Now we go to the right side, right leg up. Good job, feel the burn in the butt muscle. And again, give me two. Drop the knee, bring the leg out for three. Grip the stomach tightly. And one more time for four. Up, bring it back down. And then you're gonna take your left leg and you're gonna move it out to the side like a fire hydrant and back down. Hip opener, guys. Left leg up again, bring it out to the side, knees bent and down. Let's do it two more. Left leg up, work that outer thigh and down. One more time for four, bring it up and down and switch sides now. We're gonna go right leg up and down. Bring it up again for two and down. Up for three and four. Good job. Now you're gonna put your right hand behind your head. And you're gonna, as your hand's behind your head, you're gonna bring your elbow down facing the floor. And then twist, get a good spinal twist and look up to the right. Bring it down, let's do four. This is two. And again, three. One more, four. Good, put the hand behind the back now. Same arm, right arm behind the back. Yeah, drop the elbow and raise it. And drop the elbow for two and twist open. Drop it down for three on the elbow. Pull it back as far as you can and go for four. And down and let's switch. Left arm behind the head. Elbow goes down and then you open. So spinal twist, come on down and open. Give me three and give me four. Bravo, and let's put the hand behind the back. All right, everybody, drop the elbow and raise the elbow. Bring it down, bring it up and down for three and up. Down for four and up. Good, now I have you in the crawling position. We're gonna crawl across the floor. We're gonna go four forward, four back. So you're getting up on your toes and hands and you're gonna be a crawler. You're crawling forward for four, crawl backwards for four. Press through the arms, use your core and go forward again, backward again. One more time forward. Crawling forward just like a bear and backward. Press through those arms. Good. And from this position, you're going to go with wide feet and we're going to go into a frog push up. Just bend your elbows, bring your face close to the floor and push up and look up. So you're going to be up on your feet. So you go back down, press and look up. Good, and then down, press into frog push up and up. So you're in a squat. Down into the toes and hands, shift back into the heels, butt is down. One more time, down into the hands, shift back into the heels. Good job, everybody. You're gonna sit down now. We're not done. One more guys, one more hard one and then we'll stretch, okay? So we're gonna just do the reverse. We gotta be, a, if we were a bear, now we're gonna be a crab. So you're on your hands and you're on your feet and you're lifting your hips. If you watch that you don't hit your head anything around you, if there's anything in the way, then just stay skate right where you are. But if you can do it, let's go walking four steps forward or three, whatever you could do and come on back. Just like a crab. All right, forward. Keep your hips up, 
and back. If you don't have the room to crawl, just lift your hips and stay in the setup. Let's go one more time forward and backwards. And sit down, really good. We're gonna wind it down now with just a little bit of core work. We're gonna do what's called the penguin and the cherry pickers, okay? So for the penguin, you lie on your backs. Let me see, I'm not sure if you can see me, so let me see if I can set this up a little better for you. Yep, that should be good. Okay, good, you can see me now lying down? Yep. All right. So now what we're gonna do for the penguin is the knees are bent and the feet are on the floor and we're gonna shift all our weight left, reach your left hand as far to the left foot as you can and then shift right. So left, right, you're like a penguin. So we're covering as many animals and mammals as we can. So let's go for 10, nine, work those abs, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three more, two, and one. Good job. Then, then the last ab crunch is a cherry picker. You're on your back already. You're gonna pick your feet up, pick them up, and you're gonna reach right arm inside of left foot and down. Left arm to inside of right foot and alternate. So 10, nine, keep the feet up, eight, keep them up, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And you can sit up. I wanna thank you guys for coming and we'll take just a few moments to stretch. Let's just take a few moments and stretch our hamstrings, okay? Um, legs are out in front of you. Lean your upper body forward. <coughs> and just stretch your hamstrings, feel it in the back side of the leg. Drop your head. Sit up straight and bring your soles of your feet together for the butterfly stretch. Press your soles of your feet together, grab your hands around your shoes, and lean forward. <coughs> Feel it in your back. And then you're gonna sit up, and let's go right one more time forward into that same, same stretch. <coughs> and up. And we're gonna extend our left leg out in front of you, but the right leg is gonna go over it, bent in front of you. And we're gonna take our left arm outside our right leg and just twist, look over your shoulder. And switch, right leg goes out, left leg folds up and over. And bring your right arm to the outside of your thigh, looking left. So if your left leg's folded over, you're looking left. We'll do it one more time. We're gonna take the right leg over the left leg, left arm outside the right leg, and look right. Feel the stretch, push your elbow into your thigh for a deeper stretch, and switch. Right arm goes outside the left leg, look over your left shoulder, Great job, that was really good. Thank you so much everybody for coming. And I will see you again soon, I hope. Awesome, thank you, Kirsten. You're welcome, Nicole.